crafty friends it's caroline i just wanted to hop on really quick and show you these adorable little bookmarks i'm working on they um they're just too cute i've made them so that they'll slip over a page like this little heart portion will slip over the page and so this is what will be sticking out of the top of your book isn't that adorable and i used these dies here from Emma over at My Creative Time. I use the small ones. I'm gonna work on some big ones next. Aren't they so cute? And this is the MCT D259. And then behind them, and this isn't necessary, but I wanted to kind of put a base behind them. I like how, let's see, can you see how they're kind of matted on here? I hope that's showing up. Anyway, I liked having that kind of layered aspect. And so these dies here are, so these are the tag frame dies and they are MCT D270 and they come with a little matting set too where you can buy you buy them separately but they coordinate with this other matting set which is the um, tag frame layers dies. I didn't use those for this one but I did use this one I think. Yep this is the one I used so it was like the middle sized one and it layered perfectly behind these. <laughs> they were so fun and then I pulled in these dies here from Scrap Diva and I can't remember the name on them but I'll look it up and um, they're Valentine words and I used the love one here that you can see where it says love here and on it comes with a like a matting layer and then the words and this set has Galentine, Adore, Be Mine, XOXO, and You and Love and so these are really fun to play with. And then I'm using the papers from Country Craft Creations. And I was gonna show you the cover page, but see what I mean, you guys? I have cut up the cover page already. All of these pieces are very usable. Um, and this was the Cupid's Kiss? Cupid? Cupid's Heart, that's the name of the collection. And these papers are so pretty and so fun. And yeah, so that's what I've been working on today. I think I'm gonna include these in with some little Valentine gifts either just for my kids or maybe as classroom gifts for their school. I just love the way they sort of slip over a page like that as a bookmark and I think they're really fun. And the way I made them so they slip over was I just only glued this overlay heart up to this point. So I left this bottom part open and that way it'll just simply slip over a page and, and keep your, your place in your book. So this is my Satmore Makes today, guys. I'm having a lot of fun just making a big old mess in my craft room, <laughs> playing with all the Valentine's Day fun stuff. I'll have links in the description notes below. I'm also working on making a love album using the Scrap Diva Designs album set, the love album set. I'm probably gonna go in a slightly different direction, but I should have a video posted here in the fairly not too distant future. <laughs> I'm not sure. Um, but that's what I've got for you guys today. I hope you're having a fantastic day, being kind to yourselves and finding some messy joy in your journey today. Talk to y'all later. Have a great one. Bye -bye.